This video highlights how to install and use the VIP3 Pro Premium and VIP3 tinting accessories with the Freestyle Pro and Freestyle 2 keyboards, respectively. For this video, we will demonstrate installation of the VIP3 Pro Premium accessory onto the Freestyle Pro keyboard. However, the installation is the exact same process for the Freestyle 2 keyboard and its VIP3 accessory. Please note these accessories are not interchangeable, so you must order the correct accessory for its corresponding keyboard. The VIP3 Pro Premium accessory, part number AC925, for the Freestyle Pro keyboard, and the VIP3 accessory, part number AC820-BLK, for the Freestyle 2 keyboard. To install the accessory, you must first attach the integrated palm supports. Lay the keyboard on a flat surface and place the palm supports in front of each key module. Please note the wider end of each palm support goes toward the middle of each module. Connect the three small mounting tabs on the palm support with the three slots on the key module by sliding the palm supports towards each key module and engaging the tabs. To install the V-lifters, turn the key modules over and place on a flat surface. Each V-lifter is labeled right or left, and when correctly positioned, the V-lifter's long support leg points toward the outside edge of the key module. Next, insert the V-lifter's two end tabs into the rectangular holes. Lower the V-lifter and snap the two squeeze tabs into the palm rest. Repeat with the other side. The V-lifters have two hinged legs, which provide keyboard tenting angles of 5, 10, and 15 degrees. Out of the box, the V-lifter is set at the 5 degree tenting angle. For 10 and 15 degree tenting, Simply snap the hinged legs of the V-lifter together, forming a rigid V-shape. Then adjust between the two angles by flipping the V-lifter back and forth. To go back to the 5 degree tenting angle, pull the short and long support legs apart to release the snaps. Please note, you cannot remove the palm rest before removing the V-lifter. To remove the V-lifters, slightly press the squeeze tabs and gently lift up until the two tabs at the other end exit from the square holes. To remove the palm supports, hold a key module in one hand and the palm support in the other hand. Simply pull the palm support straight away from the key module to separate. Again. Be sure to pull the palm support straight out from the keyboard and not at an angle. To learn more about Kinesis products or find a dealer, please visit kinesis.com.